Welcome to the Faculty of Arts program in Cortona, Italy. The faculty has been running this program for over 20 years. The town of Cortona is in the south of Tuscany. It's located on the main rail line between Florence and Rome. You can see a picture of the hill town on the right. It looks out over the Val di Chiana and it is an ancient town. It has Etruscan beginnings. Uh, it was then conquered by the Romans. If you walk down the streets, you can see some of the evidence of the old Etruscan buildings, the Roman buildings, medieval buildings, and then uh, the Renaissance city, and also some modern buildings as well. We offer two different programs in the school in Cortona. First of all, we have a winter school aimed primarily at first and second year students, although undergraduates from any year are elig eligible to apply and attend. And this is a more intensive program. Students spend a term in Italy from mid-January to late March. We also offer a spring program and students can take a shorter three and a half week term either in May or June. And typically we offer 300 or 400 level courses in our spring school. For both our winter school and our spring program, all of the courses that we offer include field trips. And uh, these field trips are included in the tuition fees, so there's no additional cost to pay when you go on these. All of our courses are University of Alberta courses, and this sets the Cortona program apart from other study abroad experiences because you don't have to worry about arranging for transfer credits after you've taken the courses. They show up automatically on your Bear Tracks transcript. All of the courses are taught in English, except for the Conversational Italian course, and there are no prerequisites, so it's a good chance to take courses from other departments or even from other faculties. The courses that we offer count toward two different certificates, the European Studies Certificate, as well as the Certificate in International Learning. The next winter school that we're offering will be in 2022. This is because we had to cancel the 2021 winter school due to the pandemic. So in our winter school, we offer courses at the 100 and 200 level. So you can earn these credits while you're studying in Tuscany. We've designed the course especially to encourage first and second year students to consider spending a term in Italy at the beginning of their program. It's also a chance to get away from some of the larger lecture courses that you might find on campus in those years and take advantage of the small class sizes and the interactive seminars supported by field trips that we offer in Cortona. The courses that we offer do vary from year to year, but typically in the winter school, we offer a classics course where you can study archaeology uh, and learn about ancient Roman and Greek civilizations. We offer a conversational Italian language and culture course so that you can become more comfortable interacting with the townspeople who you'll meet while you're there. As well, uh, we have popular art history courses or you can take a political science course. The Winter School also has a core seminar. We call it the 3C Seminar, Creativity, Complexity, and Critical Thinking. It also um, gives you some of the tools and skills that you will need to deepen your intercultural learning experience. Our Spring 1 and Spring 2 terms offer you a chance to take courses in a compressed three and a half week period of time in spring one from late April to mid-May, and spring two from late May to mid-June. We typically offer 300 and 400 level courses, occasionally a 200 level course. Again, these are our University of Alberta courses, so the, the credits will automatically appear on your transcript. We also do not require prerequisites for these courses. In spring 2021, you can take history courses, an interdisciplinary course on natural disasters, which is a science course, a course on globalization, nationalism, and the European Union, or you can study Italian cinema or the Italian Renaissance city. 
All of the courses include field trips, and for spring one and two, they'll take you to places like Rome, Florence, Siena, Gubbio, and San Marino. The Cortona program is a residential program, and this means that all of the students in our winter or our spring terms stay in the Hotel Italia, which is a converted former 15th century palazzo. And you can choose from single, double, or multiple, multiple occupancy rooms. All of them are en suite. The accommodation fee also includes the cost of daily breakfast, which is on the top floor of the hotel. And dinner is served Monday to Thursday in a nearby restaurant. We also have a local residence life manager who you will come to know if you take the Cortona program. And the Residence Life Manager provides support and assistance to students. Um, our manager, Laura, uh, will sit and eat with you in the restaurant and you'll get a chance to get to know her. The classes are held in a building that's a short walk away from the Hotel Italia in the Sant'Agostino building, which is a converted 14th century convent. Some instructors hold their seminar discussions after the class over an espresso and bar sport. There's a back room there and it's large enough to hold a seminar class. This spring in 2021, we're offering three courses in both spring one and spring two. In spring one, you have a choice of History 300, which covers the grand tour, and um, you will learn about art history. Field trips include trips to Arezzo, Rome, and Florence. We have an interdisciplinary course in, from the Faculty of Science on Natural Disasters, which will take you to Norcia, Gubbio, and Vesuvius. Or you could take a political science course on globalization and nationalism that looks at Italy and, and its role in the European Union. In spring two, you can choose between studying Italian cinema in a film studies course, a history of art and design course on the Italian Renaissance city, or a political science course on populism and democracy. Students typically take either one or two courses for the spring term, and you can sign up for a single term or sign up to stay for two terms. The key dates for spring 2021 are up on our website for the Cortona program, but here is a summary for you. The spring one applications are already open. They close on March 1st and the, nom the $250 nomination fee is due on March 7th. If you are applying for spring two, you have a bit more time. You have until March 15th and your accommodation payments for spring one or spring two are due March 15th or April 1st respectively. You'll see that tuition rates are higher in Cortona than what you would pay for a course in Edmonton. So a three credit course for um, spring 2021 will cost $1,689. Some students take two courses. The accommodation fees range from um, a low of around $2,100 to, if you are in a multiple occupancy room, to $3,350 if you opt for a single occupancy room. For spring 2021, um, there's a possibility that we won't be offering the multiple occupancy room. You'll have a choice between single and double occupancy, but that will be confirmed later this, uh, later this autumn. Your accommodation fees include daily breakfast and your dinner Monday to Thursday. Your tuition fees also include your field trips. Watch our website for updates on winter term rates for 2022. But to give you a ballpark figure, you can expect that the accommodation and uh, accommodation fees will run between 4750 and 6500. Please note that these fees do not include airfare, which you must cover yourself. Now the good news is, is that all of these fees, the tuition and accommodation, are eligible for, for Alberta student loan coverage. 
Many of the students take advantage of their time in Cortona to really absorb the local culture, to take courses in pasta making as these students here. Students in winter often take the trip to Venice to take part in Carnival. Now the pandemic is still ongoing and we do plan on making a final decision on whether spring 2021 will go ahead at some point in the fall term. If we do cancel the program, we will refund any accommodation or tuition payments that students have made, but we remind you not to book any travel to Italy until you've received confirmation. For more information, send us an email or check out our website. We'd love to see you in Cortona.